Aisha. And I'm Reem. So where are you taking me tonight? I'm taking you to Dakana Abayas. It's one of my favorite places to go to for Abayas. Aisha, this is an Anoush. An abaya is like a black garment that covers the woman's body that we use in our culture and tradition. But now with fashion, we add color and uh, sequins to make it more attractive and more fashionable. You don't want to wear just a black thing every day, so we mix it up. These are all different kinds of types of abayas that you can wear and, and to different occasions, yeah? yeah? And these are all your designs. Yeah. We have like casual ones that you wear for work, we have evening ones that you go to weddings in, and we have like the ones that you go to lunch or coffee. Most of my inspiration comes like from books, from websites, it could be from anything, it could be from a tile itself or a carpet, it could be from like designers work, and I take these designs, take pictures of them, take them to my workshop and they're done over there. So, I and mean, this is all handmade, so he's literally weaving into it, isn't he? Yeah. Can you do that? <laughs> How long does it usually take to make each abaya? If it has heavy work, it takes like four or five days, but usually it's two to three days to finish one abaya. Everyone in Qatar wears abayas. Qataris wear abaya, but it's not by law, it's a cultural thing. How, how is it a cultural thing? It's like we were born into like wearing them, covering up them. Like, but in the old days, you always cover up in a black abaya that's only made from silk. But with the fashion era, it's like we added color and everything to make people like love the style and keep that culture. I heard that Harrods has a section that's for abayas as well. It's just about fashion. The society here, and the, especially the young girls, are very fashionable and they love their designer clothes, so they're implementing it into the abaya. And it's not just here, it's in Dubai, and it's in Kuwait, and everywhere. So why don't you try one of the abayas? If I try one, you try one. No, I'm ready to wear one. <laughs> we're going to leave it to you. We're going to play a little bit of dress up with you right now. We're going to try some different abayas and see how you like it. So how many abayas do you have? It's never enough. You can't ask that question. 